So I'm doing a little review on this um, Shadow Ops Digital Camo Sniper Bolt Action. As you can see, the little bolt. And it shoots like, it shoots 480 feet per second. And it comes with the bipod which you can attach to the part of the gun right there as I'll show you and to take it off there's a little button right there you just push it up and then push the bipod up at the same time it comes off then there's little buttons on the bipod right here and you press down and pull up and on the other side same thing you just press down pull up and then you do the same thing when you put them when you put them back and it also comes with two magazines And I'll insert one in the gun for you right now. And then you just stick it in the gun. You can see the little hole in the gun right there. And then the little hole for the airsoft BBs. The little hole for the airsoft BBs. You just line it up with that. Put it in. And I'll dry fire the gun so you guys can hear what it sounds like. It At the beginning, it's a little hard to pull back the bolt. But now, once you break it in, it gets better. And I'll dry fire it for you right now. And it really doesn't sound like it goes as far as it says it does, but it goes pretty far. I'll put these down. And I'll show you what else the gun comes with. So the gun also comes with a cleaning rod and a little strap so it's easier to carry the gun. And then it also comes with a speed loader, but I forgot to bring that. And on the gun, it's actually really comfortable because of the little headrest right here. And then the um the trigger hole. Or the excuse me, the um the thumb hole for your finger. And it comes in like Three different colors, I think. Um, comes in dark green, digital camo, and black and tan, I think. Or no, yeah, tan, yeah. And um, it's really, it's really fun to shoot. Except the only bummer thing is, is that when you aim and actually rest your head on the little pad for you, it makes the barrel actually go up a little bit so you have to aim a little bit behind it so this is the railing is actually flat but it's really comfortable when you go back into the position right here let's see what else Alright, well that's really all I have to say about this, but there will be a part two because I'll remember more stuff. So, I'll put, post part two on my next video of this gun. And I'll have a lot more guns, so try watching my videos. Alright, thanks for watching.